All right, so the next type of bot that we are going to look at is a quiz bot, which is going to ask the user a question and provide them with uh, multiple choice answers. And then based on the answer, uh, which is the user selection, it is going to tell them whether they got the answer correct or not. And uh, this one is based on dialogue flow. That is, it's a bot which is going to conduct a quiz on the subject of dialogue flow. As you can see, it starts off by asking which of these is used to keep track of the current state of a dialogue flow conversation. So I'm going to first check the correct answer, which is context. And as soon as I do that, you will notice that it comes back with uh, correct. That is, it, it provides feedback that the answer is correct and then moves on to the next question. Which of these can be used to configure the sensitivity of dialogue flow training phrases? And once again, I'm going to choose the right answer, which is ML threshold. And then it's going to come back with another question. Which of these is used to handle the case when Dialogflow does not know how to respond to user's request? So again, I'm going to select the correct answer, fallback intent, and then it is going to give me feedback and also end the quiz by saying thanks for taking the quiz. So let's try again. So if the user were to select the wrong answer, let's say I select history for this, it's going to say, sorry, the correct answer is context. So it's going to tell them what the correct answer was. And also it's going to ask the same second question. So the question is going to continue. It's going to continue in the same order of the questions. Uh, it's just going to tell them whether they got their answer right or not in the first text box over here. So now, what I'm going to do is uh, which of these can be configured and let's say I select the wrong answer, export agent. Say sorry, the correct answer is ML threshold. Now here, when it's asking which of these is used to handle the case when Dialogflow does not know how to hand respond to the user's request, let us say that I select follow up intent over here. You can see that even though that's the incorrect answer, the actual uh, answer should have been fall back intent. Even though I uh, selected follow up intent, it's still saying that I got the answer right and then ends the quiz by take, thanks for taking the quiz. Now let's contrast it with uh, a different choice for the answer. So let's go back here and uh, you know, just keep giving bad answers these export agent and that's going to be wrong too and here instead of follow up intent let's, let's say that I select a different wrong answer like welcome event now it says sorry the answer is fallback intent so it, it was able to identify that I uh, put in some input which is not the input that it was expecting so what happened here why did it change the response? Why, why was it not able to figure out that the answer follow-up intent was uh, incorrect? You will be taking a look at all that as we go through the actual intent design in the future video.